Hello my beautiful Virgos and welcome to your general reading. We're going to see what is coming towards you today, family, lover, friend or foe. Please remember the energies in the readings can go vice versa, okay? So only take what resonates. Feel free to switch the gender, switch the roles, do what you've got to do and leave the rest. Sorry if it's a bit dark and you can't really see me, but it is what it is. I can't... Hold on one second. I can't be bothered to turn on the lights is that better is that worse like the light is kind of on but it's not i think Cappy's reading was a bit dark but and you can see me when i'm up here yeah but it, you don't really need to see me you just need to see the cards i'm not really bothered at this point okay one second let me just double check yeah you can see the cards okay it's fine Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Sorry, I forgot I had this dress, you know. I was like, this dress is kind of cute, you know. It's kind of cute. I don't normally wear blue, but you know what I mean. So anyway, let's get into your reading. So some of you could be feeling yourself, or maybe you're like um, focusing on your body, you know. I know how you are, you're nine of pentacles, looking at me right here that you are, Virgo. Okay, but your overall energy is um, explore the layers within you, okay. And at the bottom of the deck, we have um, young natural love. I'm trying to remember who got this. I think it was Aries. You could be dealing with an Aries because I think it was Aries, okay? So you could be exploring your emotions. You could be trying to figure out how you feel about someone, okay? I feel like there's, there's, there's layers to... There's like, how can I say? I feel like your feelings for someone is like an onion. Or this is how... Excuse me. Oh, they don't want me to say that. <laughs> They're like, don't reveal my feelings. But um, I feel like your feelings... Or oh, this is how someone's feeling about you. It's like an onion. It's like the more, you know, they can just peel it and it's like never ending. You know what I mean? There's just different layers to how someone feels about you. Different depths. Different depths of how someone feels. Like, this is what I'm getting. And it's organic. It's true. It's raw. I feel like that's why it's like, I'm just getting like a never ending love story. Okay. But yeah, because I'm try I'm finding it hard to kind of get the word. So I feel like this is how someone feels about you. Someone finds it hard to get the words out. Like they can't explain how they feel. They just know that they feel something. Okay, but it's like, it's almost like someone thought, like I thought I loved you, but then boom. But wait, there's more. Like, do you know what I mean? Also, somebody could be wanting to explore the layers within you in terms of you know in a sexual way or someone just feels like you know you never cease to amaze them like there's just so much to you or this is how you feel about someone okay so are you feeling all lovey dovey um virgo oh or is someone feeling all lovey dovey about you virgo right let's just see we have take the lead. It says be a powerful force in your own right. Yes, I feel like somebody wants to take the lead to come towards you. Now, this could be what somebody likes about you. Somebody likes how you lead. Somebody likes that you're very powerful. Okay. So, yeah, it definitely could be dealing with an Aries or you could have significant um, Aries placements. Okay. Or this is you. You know, take the lead, shoot your shot. Okay. Wow, we have true love. Young, natural love and true love. We can't make this up. Gorgeous. It says, um, celebrate all the aspects of love and enjoy things that represent this for you. Yeah, exactly. All aspects of love. So maybe you're going through different things. You could be thinking about different relationships. Maybe you're thinking how much you've grown when it comes to love or somebody else. But I just feel like someone feels like you are their true love or you feel like someone is your true love and somebody here is willing to take the lead, okay? Yeah, we have forgive and move on at the bottom of the deck. So I feel like this is somebody that you've already dated. Now, for some of you, you could be forgiving someone from your past to move on because you found a new true love. It's like, you know what? That's mine right there. I've had my eye on you for a long time, you know, like, stop playing. You know what I mean? You know, you're just like, you know, are you going to come and claim me or not? Nah? Like, hello, take the lead. You're waiting for a nigga to take the lead, honestly. Or this could be somebody that wants to, you wants forgiveness so that you guys can move on from the past and be together because you've realized that you are each other's true love. 
You know what I mean? So I've been around the world, but I ain't found myself a girl like you, okay? It's almost like someone's trying to look for you in different people, but it's just, it's not, it, it's just not happening. It's, it's not happening, okay? You could not be replaced. I mean, who can replace perfection, Virgo? Is that not what you rule? Just saying. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay. Sorry, guys. So, oh, cards are just fall, fall, falling all over the place. Okay, so this is for my beautiful Virgo. So, I feel kind of uncomfortable. I feel, like, I feel like talking about feelings is making someone feel uncomfortable. Yeah. We have the kings. So it says resilience, stamina, and strength. Yeah, somebody's trying to res um, resist how they feel. Somebody could have significant um, Leo placements. It's like someone's got a lot of pride, but it's like you got to take the lead, man. You just got to take that plunge. You could be a Leo Virgo cusp. Okay. Also. But yeah, I feel like someone is att attracted to your power and your strength and your ability to keep going. Okay. Or this is you. This is why you're very attracted to someone. I feel like someone is like indestructible. I'm hearing like I must conquer you. <laughs> We have um, the shrinkage. It says before and after two sides of the same coin and something's not what it seems. Yeah, I feel like you are two sides of the same coin. Could be done with your opposite. I feel like you're one in the same. Maybe this is what this person has realized with the true love. Or like I said, you don't know how much somebody feels about you. It's like you feel like this is all they have to offer, but they it, it just goes on and on forever. Okay, maybe you've helped someone to see two sides or different layers of themselves. Again, sorry that it's like gone really, really dark. Okay, and then we have the tribal. It says tradition, ceremony, and culture. Yeah. So I feel like somebody wants a traditional relationship with you or somebody also may like the fact that you're really into your culture. Like somebody really loves that. They find that really sexy because, you know, a lot of people are estranged from their culture in this day and age. I feel like you keep your culture alive. So someone likes that. I'm getting like a spiritual ceremony here. But yeah, I feel like with the tradition, I feel like somebody wants to respect and honor you. Okay. So this is for my beautiful Virgo. Please clarify, take the lead in the kinks. Yeah, someone has been guided to come towards you, okay? Or this is you. Your spirit guides are taking, are guiding you to take the lead, to give you strength to do something, okay? Could be dealing with someone who's overseas. Also, this could be about you traveling, moving. Some of you, this could actually be about a vehicle. Maybe somebody wants you to be like the lead driver or like a chauffeur or something like that. But yeah, I feel like it's saying take the lead towards love. Literally, the Ace of Cups. Towards your feelings or this offer is coming to you. So it could be dealing with the, let's say that, an Aquarius. Yeah, somebody wants you to forgive and let something go with the Eight of Cups here. It could be dealing with the Pisces. Okay. It's almost like somebody's, oh, good God. It's almost like someone's walking... Oh, my God. <laughs> someone can't get a grip on you. I feel like someone feels like they're losing you, Virgo. It's almost like someone's coming after you because they can see you're just walking away. You're just like, listen, I'm going, I'm out. It's like, true love, what true love? True love, where and which part? But someone's like, no, Virgo. And it's like they're, it's like they're trying to get you and, you know... Cause I, kept, I kept on... I couldn't get my grip on the cards. I feel like someone is losing control. Someone is losing control over you... I mean, as usual, Virgo, you always have somebody stressed over you. But someone's like, can we let the past go and move forward? But I feel like someone is seeing that you're walking away. Yeah, look, I am on point like a good joint. Literally, I just said someone's like looking at you walking away. Literally, they can see you. Here is the page of swords. It's almost like you're walking away and someone's like, wait a minute, where are you going? Like, let's just, just stop right there. Like someone's just stopping you right in your tracks. <laughs> That same person that was behind you is like, bitch, I'm Houdini. Here I am. Okay. So someone is watching you. They're spying on you, but they don't want to see you um, walk away. They don't want to see you move on. Yeah. Somebody's like prepared to kind of sabotage anything. Maybe somebody wants forgiveness for doing that as well. Okay. Oh my goodness. I hope I didn't just show you guys my front part. I didn't, I didn't really look at what I was doing just then. This is for my beautiful Virgos. So please clarify um, the Eight of Cups. So yeah, it definitely could be dealing with your opposite sign, Pisces, or someone who has significant Pisces placements. 
Yeah, this could be someone who abandons things and just runs away. And you're just like, you know what I mean? Virgos, you need that security. You're just like, you know, I don't have time for your fucking games, man. But it's like every time this person walks away, they want to come back or... Because I feel like someone is your true love. Whether you want to admit that to yourself or not. So yeah, definitely could be dealing with someone who's got Aries placements as well. Just as I fucking said that, we have Aries, the four of wands. I mean, good God. Yeah, somebody is walking towards this relationship. Yeah, like I said, somebody's very unstable, but they're walking towards stabilizing themselves and their emotions. So I feel like somebody wants to be serious with you. All I see is you. I'm seeing wheat and huts and all types of things. I just heard and candy and nuts. Somebody wants to build something with you. I feel like someone feels like they have like this original raw love for you. Yeah, justice. You are somebody's karmic love, but not in a bad way. Like, you know how all these readers always like the karmic this and the karmic that? Karmic is just derived from the word karma. It just, to me, karma just means consequence, okay? I feel like you are someone's consequence of a past life action like someone owes you or is owed to you or you're in debt to this person yeah look good god justice um the ace of cups and the king of cups this love is your justice this is your person you was contracted to be with this person or someone was contracted to be with you i feel like somebody is coming to give you justice it's almost like someone's looking right at their karma they're looking right at you or, you know, you could be a Libra, Virgo, Cusp also. A Vibra. Okay. But yeah, you're going to get justice in this situation, especially if somebody walked away. Now, like I said, for others of you, you could be letting somebody go from the past and you're walking into something really beautiful. Okay. Because it's your justice. You know, people keep abandoning you. Yeah, it could be somebody completely new. And this person is going to love you and they're going to invest in you. And they're going to think the world of you. Moving forward to success and abundance. They feel like you are so attractive and so fucking beautiful, okay? And this person is going to shine with you and adore you. So like I said, this could be a new person or this could be somebody coming back brand new. You're just like, well, thank God for that. <laughs> what I mean? So I just heard someone had to lose their mind and lose you to find their way. Wow. Okay, we have desire, yeah. Because you are what this person desires. You are what they want. Can we have another message from the fairies, please? But maybe somebody went through karma with the justice card being at the bottom of the deck. It's almost like someone looked justice right in the eye, looked karma right in the eye. You could have significant Libra placements. Okay, yeah, tipping point. Yeah, someone's at their breaking point. Someone's at their breaking point. And then, yeah, feel the feels. It looks like someone wants to reconcile with you here, celebrate with you. I'm getting that three of cups energy here. But yeah, feel the feels. Someone's in their emotions. They want forgiveness. Okay, like I said, the depth that somebody feels about you is like... I feel like it unravels each and every day, Virgo. If you knew better, you'd do better, yeah. I feel like someone didn't know back then. They lost their way, but now they know. Yeah, you need to relax. Yeah, someone, like I said, someone's at their tipping point, at their breaking point, Virgo. I feel like somebody's like a nervous wreck. Yeah, you deserve this abundant stunt on these hoes, yeah. I feel like you're getting karma, that good karma okay you're gonna get to stunt on people or this person is coming to give you this karmic reward yeah you need to drink more water so maybe that's what you need to do to help this situation to help the emotions flow or this is this person but i feel like somebody wants to pour their heart out so you may become increasingly thirsty for like no reason i feel like someone is like it's an it's a representation of someone's love for you like the Ace of Cups that we just saw pouring out, okay? I feel like every time you drink, someone's thinking about you in a loving way or some shit, okay? Uh, I confidently pursue my dream, my, the, I confidently pursue my passions and dreams, yeah, exactly. 
take the lead be confident if this is you going after what you want what you love or this could be why you're getting this abundance because you go after something confidently also i feel like this is somebody coming to confidently pursue you after just spying and then i forgive myself for any past mistakes and move forward yeah so we have that energy here twice so i feel like someone is not really pleased with how they treated you in the past they know that they did wrong they know that they did you dirty someone needs to forgive themselves first and then they can come and ask forgiveness from you okay oh wait hold on Like I said, for other you, others of you, you could be forgiving the past, which is allowing you to move on and to find new love. So just before someone's like, oh, I'm not interested in the old person. Okay. Let's use our brains now. I don't have to say that to you, though, because Virgos, you're not stupid. You know how to, like, you know what I mean, decipher and decode and... Okay, we have nurture. Yeah, somebody wants to nurture this relationship, the foundation of this. I feel like someone just imagines like living in some type of far away fairyland out in the I just had the suburb like, out in the out in nature just being with you. Okay. Yeah, manifest manifester creator. Yeah. Someone's trying to pull you in or someone's gonna take action. Yeah, sorcery revolution. Yeah, I feel like you're supposed to do some revolutionary things with this person. I'm hearing like uh, me and you against the world, or we're here to change the world. Okay, well, because there's so much love and my love cards just happen to be right next to me. Let's just pull. What does this person have to say to you, whoever's coming towards you? Um, I want to make love to you. Oh, okay. And um, I want to take it slow with you. Yeah, somebody really wants to like build and take it slow and do things properly. It's kind of what I'm getting here. And um, I don't know what to say to you. Yeah, someone's struggling with the words. We was getting that earlier. Um, but I want to take you away. Yeah, somebody wants to take you away. Like I said, I literally just said that. I feel like someone wants to, like, be with you in the middle of nowhere, like, surrounded by nature and trees. And I'm lost without you. Yeah, well, we already know that. And um, I want to be honest with you. Yeah, somebody wants to tell you the truth about something. Okay. Okay, thank you so much, my beautiful Virgos. If you like the reading, do not hesitate to like, share, and subscribe. Bye.